Uh, I met them actually through Jason Crawford and Robbie Stevens, our drummer. Uh, we played together with Reagan Boggs, and um, we uh, enjoyed playing with each other and always had a good time playing music, so we uh, decided to go in a different direction, and, and we got Ed Main playing with us, uh, and Jim Price, he played with Reagan as well, so uh, Ed is probably the only one that we plugged in, you know, to to do that. That gave me a chance to expand my horizon, so to speak, in music and play some loud stuff. Plug in this banjo and mandolin and see what it sounds like. Yeah, play some rock and roll, do all kinds of different stuff, and that's, uh, that's really where we're at now, uh, trying to write some original music and, and just let everything fall into place where it will. Well, we've been working on a, a, our first CD now for probably almost a year, and uh, we recorded the majority of it at Maggard Sound Studio in Big Stone Gap, Virginia. Uh, the overdubs and the vocals were recorded at Bobby Starnes' studio, Hog Holler, uh, in, uh, in Kingsport, Tennessee. Bobby Starnes is also a close friend of mine, great musician, songwriter. The songs on the CD uh, are mostly original. Uh, two that I was uh, real flattered that they picked of mine. Jason wrote two of them. Uh, some other uh, buddies of ours in Nashville wrote a couple, uh, Mylon Miller and Mark Bumgarner. And of course, Tim Stafford and Bobby Starnes from, from here in Kingsport were uh, kind enough to, to let us have some of their great stuff. Uh, well, I've written two of the songs that are on the CD coming out, and uh, one of them's entitled uh, Stay the Course. It's, it's a, one that we probably won't perform live very much. It's, it's just one that I, I wanted to put on the CD. I writ, wrote it uh, probably 10 or 12 years ago. It's a gospel tune. Um, and uh, it's, it's kind of just really old time. It's only the guitar and the bass and uh, four part vocal harmony. And uh, I think that's one of our strong points is Wolf Creek is a, a strong harmony. Everybody sings harmony with one another really well. So well, we've got that four part harmony gospel song. Uh, it's just gonna be a joy to listen to. It's not necessarily one we're gonna put in the show, but just a, a, real, a real good tune to put on the CD and let people enjoy the variety. Uh, the other song is called Home to Carolina. Uh, and I'm not from Carolina, but our good buddy Robbie, the drummer, he is. So I kind of had him in mind when I wrote the song. Uh, it, it talks about uh, being away from home, traveling, playing music. And, uh, and so now one of the lines in the song is, just 500 miles and I'll be home. And it talks about driving through Tennessee to get to, to North Carolina. And uh, just, just how Robbie has to spend a lot of his time playing music away from home. and. Uh, just, just a cute little story about uh, uh, the ballad about, about being away from home and, and longing to get back to Carolina. The two songs that I wrote, one of them uh, is a song that talks about what a hard time the coal miner had in the early days before OSHA and before they had anybody actually looking out for them and what a, what a hard, hard life they had and uh, how much they contributed to the, uh, the economy of the time. The other song is uh, just kind of a, a spiritual anti-war kind of song uh, without getting too, stepping on anybody's toes. And it's a song about happy, being you know, peaceful and happy. So it's, uh, hopefully, hopefully we'll, it'll, it'll make an impact somewhere. It's uh, everything, the material we're doing is so different. I, uh, I've played in uh, rock bands, I've played uh, gospel music, uh, and country, and of course, this band is so versatile. It's just, it's great, I'm, I'm loving it. The thing I think is unique about Wolf Creek is the versatility. Uh, we have players that have backgrounds that are so diverse that it really, uh, erases a lot of the limitations on the type of material we can do. Uh, and we've just kind of, we've used that to our advantage to be able to entertain uh, a, as wide a range of folks that we can. Uh, we, we like to be able to, to reach out and have a little something for everybody, no matter your age group or your musical taste. That's one of the things that, that we try to do. And I think the, the backgrounds of these players allows us to do that. I would say that the versatility is the most important thing to me because we, 
do such a diverse style of music that uh, it's real enjoyable to flip from one style to another. And um, that's probably the biggest thing. Um, you're not confined to one style. So we're all on the same page musically. It's just a joy, a blessing to play with these guys musically. Um, it, it's, it's just a blast. I, don't, I can't put it any other way. But a little bit of you.